My name is Judy Pigman. My father uh, was in World War II. He was uh, a glider pilot. He was in the Battery B 650th Glider Field Artillery Battalion. Um, I was born in February of 1945, and he didn't receive my, the notification of my birth through the Red Cross and probably until mid-March mid of 1945. Um, on March the 23rd of 1945, he flew a mission in, uh, in, with his glider and um, he had just received word of my birth and so to commemorate my birth and to bring him good luck, he uh, made this canvas with my full name on it, Judy Lynn, and he attached it to his glider. And they flew the mission and his glider was shot down. He survived and um, he went back to the glider and got this canvas, took it off of the glider and brought it home with him. Um, as I was growing up, my father would from time to time bring out this piece of canvas and tell me the story of uh, the history of this and would always tell me that he felt that this saved his life and this brought him safely home to me and to my mother. Um, I didn't really get it. I didn't uh, really ask very many questions, which I deeply regret at this point. Um, I would love to know more about my father's war experiences. Um, my father died um, on March 23rd, um, exactly the same day that he flew this mission. 45 years later, March 23rd, he died, which I think is kind of ironic. Here's a picture of my father. and this was taken just before the army. I'm very proud of him, <laughs> needless to say. The other thing that when I was going back to bring out this canvas uh, to come today, I found a journal that a corporal in my father's battalion uh, wrote uh, uh, talking about the times, describing the times that they were all together. So over the years I knew this was here, but I never paid any attention to it. So this week when I pulled this out, I got out this journal and I read it uh, word for word. It's wonderful. It, it covers uh, the history of when they, when they enlisted, uh, their, all of their training, and then all of the different battles that they went through. It journals uh, all of the, the men who were lost, who did not make it back and it actually describes the evening of uh, March 23rd, 1945, when my father attached this uh, piece of canvas to his glider. And uh, so all of these are, to me, real treasures. And um, I just wish I could sit down with my father uh, and hear more about what happened. So tell me a little bit about that journal. Um, who wrote that? Was it him or was it somebody in the No, year? it was a corporal, uh, Corporal Melvin Manley is his, word, is his name. And um, he just broke it down into uh, different like uh, basic training, glider training, winter maneuvers, um, training in England, the Battle of the Bulge, over the Rhine, uh, actually the flight that my father did um, when he used when he put this canvas uh, on the glider uh, was the uh, a flight over the Rhine, and uh, it talks about all of the men who did come back, who did survive. It also lists uh, the men who lost their lives in the war. And I'm really pleased to have this. This is just a history that uh, has been buried in a closet for a long time and now I have more detail about what my father went through and his experiences. Since I can't talk with him, uh, he's been gone 17 years, since I can't talk with him about these experiences, this is what I have left of my father and his war effort and I'm very proud of him.